we're live. Hey. Hello. Hello. What about a timer? A timer. Use timer. Use timer. We got a timer. I, I, okay. Okay. Let's see. Go on. My advertisement is going. Oh, good. You're good. Giving us that one person, one cent. Well, I mean, you need people in your chat since yeah. you have no one. <laughs> They'll come. Anyway, uh, this is Podcast Podcast episode 37, recorded on April Fool's. April Fool's Day. Uh, yeah, April Fool's. April Fool's. Uh, bad news: Podcast is bankrupt, and we're all being sued. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yay. Yay! Well, technically, I'm not an employee, so. Uh, I don't see my my um my workers comp. I don't, workers I don't know. Yeah. Where's my my benefits? You know, <clears throat> uh, you get uh, free sodas. Oh, that's true. That's true. That is a benefit. That is a benefit. <laughs> uh, yeah. But yeah, I'm Surfer Dude. I'm Necrothine. I'm Mr. Fluffs. Yes. So, well, yeah. N- Mr. Fluff, we seen you for the last couple of weeks or so, but we haven't seen Necro in a while. We've oh, been here in a while. Yeah, where have you been? I've been doing school stuff. Well, so. He got kidnapped, remember? Well, that yeah. Well, in in division. In division, you got kidnapped. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And we for... decided to not go save you for a while. Well, no, we yeah. decided to prep first, then go to save. You. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's key. I'm, I'm so we're prepping up. to yeah. save you. I'm yeah. held up by the cleaners right now. Okay. Yeah. Okay. yeah. <laughs> but preparing for midterms and all that jazz. Was it midterms last week? Yes. And, and that's why he's here this week. Yes. Okay. <laughs> that's why I'm here. Okay. Uh, yeah. I've risen from the dead and I am here. Well, you risen again. Yeah. Okay. You re risen. Uh, what life are you on now? Six, eight? 16. 16? I don't know. I okay. 42? <laughs> 69. 69. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. But uh, what about you, Floss? What have you been up to? Basically, just division. Division. All week. Right. I haven't touched Destiny in make maybe two weeks. Wow, two weeks. A whole two weeks. Yeah. Yeah, wow. Yeah. Just yeah. in time for the Destiny update. Yeah, yeah. I'll be refreshed, you yeah. know? Yeah. I'm going to get into Destiny this weekend because it's um, Iron Banner. Okay. It's Iron Banner, so I need to get in there and get some nice. stuff. Nice. Yeah. It might be a little too late, though. But still, I'm going to go in there. Yeah. It's never too late. Use the controls again. Because I tried... Oh, actually, no. I lied. April Fool's. I did touch Destiny like one day out of the two weeks. It was so hard to get back in there. Nah, it's not like, too hard. I tried rolling. Okay. And using cover. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, using cover is not always a bad thing. P- by pressing A, you jump. Oh, well, yeah. The, yeah. You, that, okay, yeah. I see what your point is, but... Yeah, yeah, but it was still pretty hard. I mean, I only tried one match online, so... There was a game or something I was playing. Uh, there was... I'm not sure which one. It was, like... Like... L- like, it was, like, uh, left click was, like, to select, and right click was to fire or something. Uh-huh. Just, just... I don't know what it was, but okay. this is an example. And then I switched to another game, which was... It was reversed... So oh, that it was sucked. it was like right after each other, and so it was like really bad. But yeah, yeah I understand your pain. Yeah. Um, I'll get back into it though. Yeah. It don't it only take like a couple hours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Muscle memory, bring it back. Mm. <laughs> yeah, but uh, yeah. So Destiny update, April. Gotta get ready for it. Yeah, yeah. Have you guys seen? Well, I know you've seen. A lot. I, I've seen the streams. I quickly forget though. Okay. So. Have you seen? Do you know what's going on? Were Destiny? Yeah. yeah. I, I've just seen like the new weapons that are coming out, the new armor, and that's pretty much yeah, Basically, all. all we've seen is what we're going to do and the new yeah. weapons and, and armor. And the new strike. And, and the new strike. Yeah. And then uh, our favorite, uh, was it uh, the Coliseum, or was it the... Prison of Elders. Prison, Prison of, Elders. of Elders. That's coming back. Prison Elders. of Elders. <coughs> Welcomes you. I don't have that voice. <laughs> you got to bring it back. Come you got to prep it. <laughs> Should be fun. Yeah. To be back. Yeah. We don't need a key anymore for the chest. No, we don't. At the end? But we need yeah. chroma. We need lots of chroma. We need lots of chroma. Yeah. Lots of chroma. Because lots you can chroma. sort of customize your gear now. You yes. can now apply glowing effects. Mm-hmm. Should be pretty cool. Yeah. To gear and weapons. Yeah. I'm excited about the weapons. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah I, I'm going to do all green, my gear, of mm-hmm. course. Mm-hmm. Of course. And then my weapon's going to be red. Yeah. Okay. 
And then, are you guys excited for that um, Taken Sword? Yes. Mm. Yeah, that's good. I, I I bet it's gonna be pretty hard to get though. Probably. Yeah. It's gonna take a lot of like grinding and stuff. Uh, it was not fun to get the first sword. Mm-mm. No. You're on mission, Necro, to get all three, right? Yes, and for both characters, I have. I just need to beat the 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 strike for for both characters. And then they okay. The, and then the one where both. you have to dance around and defeat the one that you need. Yes. yes. Okay. The one. That's so after that was that, fun. Then I'll have all three. And what will we do with them once you have all three? Nothing. Okay. Brag about it. Absolutely <laughs> nothing. Well, you could put it all into one character, take it on a raid, and just constantly yeah. switch it out. Yeah. yeah pretty, pretty much. That. The red one, the fire one, is pretty yeah. strong. That's what Like the really trigger like. one, it's called like Falcon something. Yeah. It's pretty strong. That's like the strongest attack of all the swords. Yeah. But, like, I love the Void one because it could do the spinning thing. It's so much fun. Cool. So much fun. I like the lightning one that I got. The I throwing can, one? Yeah, I can throw it. There's a glitch where you can throw the, any sword like that. Mm. You just have to have one ammo, and you need to do the the right trigger. And then the, I think, it's, which was the one where you hit? That's the left, right bumper? Yeah. Well, it depends on your control scheme. Oh, default. Necro. <laughs> well, the right bumper is... Is, is, is like regular hit, yeah. and then right trigger is like the yeah, heavy yeah. one, right? Yeah. Okay, if you do the right trigger, and then the right bumper, right away after the right trigger, yeah, it throws the sword, any sword, doesn't matter. It throws it kind of like the lightning one. Whoa. And it does the effect, too, the lightning effect. It's pretty nice. cool. Yeah, mm. I do it. It's fun. Uh, let's see. We also are getting uh, more vault space. Yes. Legendaries are coming back from year one. Mm-hmm. How much more? One page. One page, which is like 20? Maybe hey, a guys. little bit more, 30? It's another page. I'm, I'm that's pretty good. I'm yeah, not yeah, complaining. Yeah, that's pretty good. Now, the question is, like, I know on 360, they, that was a big issue, was increasing vault space. Is this now only going to be for Xbox One and PS4? No, because they didn't say Xbox One only or PS4 only. Hmm. They sh- they would have specified it would have been only two. Yeah, Next I know they had to do like a kind of a workaround to make it yeah, work on yeah. last gen, but I don't think that's the real reason though. No, I could kind of see it. Like, really? Yeah, I don't think so because it's just server space. Well, server space with uh, with everyone else. So then it's not really a hardware capability, you know. Well, you got load everything i mean mm, yeah i, I kind of see it for last gen because it's like it's not like two or three years ago it's 12 years ago yeah true of like the hardware mm-hmm. i mean even, but even now like the hardware now is like you know five or six years for xbox one or something yeah so i just hope destiny 2 is next gen well it ha- well it's going next to gen is current gen it's yeah. not next gen anymore it's just yeah you guys are outdated come on <laughs> yeah i'm i think that's what i'm more excited about because right now yeah. everything's being held back because it's got to work on the last gen as well as the fr- current gen. Yeah. Kind of like the division, it works really well next gen. Like, yeah, it's, yeah, it is all. Current, I mean, I don't current see gen. current gen. Yeah. yeah. I don't see many, like, you know, um, what would you call it? Frame rate drop? I guess. Yeah. I, I see it occasionally depending on what, what's going on. Mm-hmm. But that was like, man, it was like week one or two. Yeah. Where it was like super busy. Yeah. Uh, but, uh, let's see there was like one more thing, uh, for destiny because we're going to go to the division because you're two weapons. Well, not your two weapons bringing up to year two. Well, it's year one weapons, legendaries. That, yeah. And a few exotics. Still I'm no- just excited about the cream queen breakers bow. I think it's so fun to play with. Yeah. That's the Do one you think we will <laughs> ever have Galhorn come back? I doubt Possibly. it. <laughs> no, it's no. gonna be really nerfed if no, because it it's yeah, yeah. If they do, it has to be like tremendously nerfed. Yeah, because it was a little too powerful. It was good though. It was good though. <laughs> I remember when Necro finally got it. <laughs> I got it when it was worthless. Yeah. <laughs> I I got it when it was when during our video of uh, when we first did Prison Elders. Oh got, yeah, that's I got in the got chest. It. I was like so chest. excited at the chest. Yeah, I remember that one day. I, I'm pretty sure I've said it already, but one day. I did all three Nightfalls, and then all three Nightfalls, I got the Galahorn. And you already had one before that. And I had one already. And then I got another one later on. So in total, I got like five. Mm. 
I only have like maybe two now because I dismantled them. They're useless, yeah. but I still have my one around. Your year one? Yeah, because I, I've what I'm hoping for is you can get like your own space and then they'll have a fireplace that you put like on, above your mantle. Yeah, that'd be fun. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I don't think it's gonna happen anytime soon. Yeah. Uh. Oh yeah. So I do have an image of the PS4 exclusive, uh, exotic weapon. Okay. It's a sniper rifle. Is it for this DLC? Yes. Or update. Yes. So it's going to come ahead. Uh, I do have it set up so I can actually be shown on the video as well. Zen Meteor. Ooh. Complete awareness, complete focus, a yes. mind sharpened by diligence to a single deadly point. That is mm. just sexy. Yeah. Um, and then here's. Do we have the stats or no? Not oh. yet. Ooh. Yeah. That looks sexy. That does look sexy. Why did they not show that in the stream? Don't know. Let's see if I... Um, but yeah. Ooh. PS4. Not really talking about any stats here. Upload. Yeah. But it goes like all red when they when it shoots. That's cool. Yeah. It's pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah. It's a sniper rifle. Yeah. I, I, I still need to... I'm not even level... What's the max level? 30? Yeah, I'm, I'm not even there. I'm like level 15 on the PS4. The new max level is going to be 40. For regular? Oh, wait, for for which one? Does that say? Yeah. No, the max level is 40. That's what I said. No, you said 30. Did you? No, and right now it's 30. Oh. But it's, gonna, it's going to be 40. Am I going to increase it? Yeah. For what? Reasons. <laughs> Reasons. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, I guess. All right. Uh, 335 light yeah yeah what did we say last time I, I know I remember saying like 350 I don't yeah it's been a while it's, it's been a long it week 40. it is 40 that's what I'm saying oh okay yeah it, it, they're gonna not increase the light level but increase the normal level right is what you're saying oh by increasing the light level of all the gear it increases your level no, I'm talking about like the, you know, like when you don't even get to light level yet. You have, you're like grind, when you first start Destiny, and you're level one, mm -hmm. you grind up to level 30 or 40, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. That's, they're going to increase that. Uh huh. Yeah. I think that's going to be like 40. So they're going to increase it by 10. Hey, and, hello, Hunter Stick. Yeah. Hey. But they're going to increase that level and the light level, is what you're saying. Yes. I'm not sure. But I'm not sure about that. No? it was just like the... If, if you get the new I armor, might be wrong. I could be wrong. That's why I'm saying I'm not sure about that. If you get like the new armor with the chroma, then it raises your light to 335. That's what mm -hmm. I heard. Yeah, I, I know yeah. they're going to increase light level. I don't know about the other level. Wait, has it... It's been 30 since forever, right? That's why 5, remember. Or... But no, they... They well, increased it with the Taken King. First, first it was um, level twenty. That was the highest, and then with the update, it was level thirty. Because you got this thing. No. Well, they got this thing where you can increase it to the max old light level. Yeah. Or not light level, but just level. Right. And so, yeah, I don't. I'm not sure about that, but we'll see. I mean, More experience. Me. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to play with other weapons. Yeah, should be cool. Yeah, there was like, there was one or two uh, exotics that are coming back that I was kind of excited for. Um, the one invisible one that's coming back. Ooh, patience, the, um, patience and time. Patience, patience and time. That one? Yeah, it's coming back. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Um, I should have prepped the list. Queen Breaker's bow. <laughs> yeah. Is that a sniper rifle? That is the sniper. That's the one that charges up. Yeah. It's a scout rifle. It's the one that the falling time. uses. Yeah. The okay. arc, arc one. They, what, what was the other one? Okay, uh, I can, I can oh, show you while you talk. No, I know what you. Uh, I think I know what you're talking about. Uh, now I remember. Uh, Icebreaker. That's not coming back either. No, I'm fine with it. I I I like that one. You can still use it. You can, but it's like really underpowered. But in PVE, yeah. Yeah. In PVP, it's not that bad. Eh. As long as you, if you get a headshot, you're still gonna kill him. Mm. It's still one hit headshot. One sh headshot kill. Okay. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Oh yeah, so division. Mm -hmm. Yes, we've been playing that. I'm max level thirty now. Damn. Um, uh, it was a little bit grindy towards the end. Like yeah, a little bit. 
Yeah. But uh, I mean, I kept... basically, if you don't do any side missions at all, you're gonna be underpowered for you... the missions. Well, there's like a point where you can't go to the higher. You can't. I was like, I did like the story missions, mm-hmm. and I didn't do any side missions, and then mm-hmm. it was like, it jumped from like level ten or fifteen to like level twenty five yeah, or it something. Jumps. A lot. It jumps. Yeah. Like, it, maybe it wasn't those exact numbers, but it, it jumped, wasn't that much. But yeah, <laughs> it jumped quite a bit. So you had to do story missions. Like it was like halfway through the game, I would say. Like, mm-hmm. like uh, the Mad Hands like split. There's like I think it jumped from eighteen to twenty two, something like that. Yeah. So you did have to do a little side missions too. But like the way I play with games is like I always like to be like a level or two higher than the minimum. Okay. Or something you know, just as like a little bit of cushion, uh-huh. just so it's not too difficult mm-hmm. when i just want to play for story i'm not really okay. playing for gear mm-hmm. uh, so i played that and uh there was like a, at one point i kind of just put on like a podcast or something and did like a bunch of side missions and kind of did that on the side, side. missions are fun yeah they were all right they're fun i mean they're repetitive it's the same thing but they're still fun i'm kind of on the fence about going back and getting all the collectibles because it wasn't too difficult mm. it's not too difficult but it's time consuming yeah that's why i'm debating on it because I never do collectibles, really. Yeah. I mean, if I see a cell phone and it's like maybe 10, 20 meters from me, I yeah. might go look for it. But if I have to get into the building to actually look for it, yeah. then no. It's a good way to get a uh, good experience early on. Yeah. yeah. To get all those because you get XP, you get XP every time. Mm. Um, but there's like really interesting stories I hear from like all the collectibles, too. So that's the other From thing. the Echoes? Well, the Echoes and then also the other stuff to pick up, too. Because there's like other stuff, like uh, there's like supposedly like a cleaner that has like a really good, interesting story. That oh, okay, I've read a couple of those, yeah, those story things, yeah, yeah. So it's, it's usually where you have to find the person, and it's like five different echoes, right? Though that's well, where it gives you like a good little story. Well, yeah, there's that, but I mean, like, uh, like supposedly, like I saw like a new story or something, I didn't read it, but it was mm-hmm. like Michael or something, the cleaner, and then it's like, it's I don't know if it's echoes or not, but it's like a bunch of collectibles and it adds up to like a story oh, okay. or something that's like hidden. Hmm. But yeah. Um, what do you think of the campaign like story? Uh, well, that's what I was going to ask is like, do we want to do a mini discussion now and then do a full discussion later on? Let's just do the mini and not do a, a full one later on. Eh. Uh, I still haven't beat the game. I'm well, yeah, still... that's why I'm kind of holding Well, off. there's nothing to spoil really. Well, Sort of. Later. Well, oh, basically, what would you think of it? Yeah. We'll, Yay, we'll, we'll, yeah, we'll, ish. Yeah, we'll do a mini one, and uh-huh. then we'll figure out later on. Yeah. All right. Uh, I thought it was all right. It was Destiny esque, you know, kind of collectible loot grinding kind of thing. Is you know that kind of itch. Mm-hmm. But uh, did you think there was too much hype? No. No. I, no, I think it was... think it was the same problem with Watch Dogs. At least my problem was like I really liked the first video they showed, and it's nothing like that first video. I mean, this one is not as dramatic like as Watch Dogs was. Like it's still like I w- I went back and rewatched that video once I was level thirty and done mm-hmm. to kind of like kind of compare, and it's it was pretty close. They did change quite a bit, but it they didn't everything that was shown there is in the game is just not. I mean, exactly. quality like well the definition qu- well quality yeah it took a little bit down but i'm talking about like uh like there was pvp and stuff in the city but that uh, oh, okay. was I... that got changed to just being in the dark zone okay okay so it wasn't just everywhere it was now just only a small area so it's there it's not just a not... bad thing no. i don't think that's a bad thing yeah because there would be like lots of trolls it'll be yeah it'd be chaos they're already in the dark zone <laughs> Keep them there. Yeah. It's the dark zone. I mean, yeah. that yeah, that one's good, but there was, like, other things that um, I'm not sure that, uh, I mean, there was, like, the tablet game where your friends could hop in on, like, a phone or something. It would that was cool. canceled. That yeah. was canceled because they thought it would be... Overpowered. It would unbalance the game. Yeah. Yeah. I did read about that. Yeah. It was an app. It was I mean, canceled. yeah, it was just, like, eh. I mean... It like I said, it wasn't as bad as Watch Dogs was. Like mm-hmm. it was, it it over Watch Dogs really overhyped what was possible, and then when it came out, it was like, mm-hmm. meh, yeah, kind of thing. That's uh, why. That's why I just like playing the game. Like I don't yeah. 
base myself because I mean all the E3 trailers and all that everything's optimized so people would like be excited about the game right and then obviously it's not going to be that because if it's kind of like an open world it has to render too much yeah and even for just next gen it's yeah and that was the other thing it was like in the tra- in the E3 demo it, like the cities were the streets were like really populated like really well done mm-hmm. and then when the game in the vision game now it's like very scarce so, yeah it's not that much yeah so just like well there's some areas where there's like a lot of cars and it's kind of populated but yeah there are other areas well not to like that degree in no. the video like it, have you seen it recently or have you either i have it okay no and we'll go but i sort of know what you mean though yeah, yeah. with the, the trailer or the the three reveal trailer oh no i haven't seen that was like two years ago yeah yeah maybe three now oh, okay it's but... been a while yeah. Did they actually show gameplay or? Did they yeah, they showed gameplay. gameplay. Yeah. They, they showed gameplay. Oh, okay. The, uh, it was when Ubisoft did that, like that one more thing. It was like that. Uh, they did that for Watch Dogs and uh, Rainbow Six Siege. Oh, okay. Hmm. It was like th- those reveals. I don't think they did one last year. Mm-hmm. Because of like the whole thing. Isn't I think it's is it? I think it's Activision. Is not going to have a lot, I guess, a place in E3 this year, right? Oh, uh, it's not it's not Activision. It's uh, EA. No. No. I think, th- I think it is Activision. It's not Activision. I know that because that's Blizzard and such. Um, or maybe they're not going with the humon- humongous place. They're going like smaller, I think. I did hear some news about them. No, yeah, we talked about that. Um, it's not like you know, like it's not the main three. Well, Nintendo has their own thing, but they're mm-hmm. still there at E three. Yeah. But yeah, I think it. I think it is EA. It's not. It's not Ubisoft. Ubisoft's still there, but it's like one of those things. Yeah, it is EA because they're moving. They're doing like a big sports thing too. Okay. Uh, basically, they're they're going to do it their own thing in a different place. The week before, or a few days before E3. Oh, okay. So, it's still going on. It's so, just, they're just not going to pay <laughs> to be in there. Well, no, they're still paying to be across the street. It's just they're doing it next door on their own thing. So, it's like all EA here hmm. kind of thing. Hmm. Which I'm, I've been noticing a lot of people have been doing that. Like, uh, they're doing, like, Marvel and Star Wars is not going to be in Comic-Con, I think, next what? year. Yeah, so they're not, well, they're, I mean, there's still going to be people there that are going to celebrate those things, but like, the in, like, like the company coming there and doing some a booth for something there, they're doing it, uh, I think they're moving it to D3, D23, which is like their own Disney Comic Con. Oh, is it? Okay. I don't know. But yeah, that's maybe, going on. I don't, maybe it's getting too expensive for yeah, them. Maybe. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's definitely getting bigger. That's one thing. Is it? Yeah. Especially Comic Con, it's like you gotta like you gotta oh, yeah, sign Comic-Con, up. Yeah. yeah, to buy like I went I tried buying tickets one time and it was like a three step process over six or eight months to yeah. be able to buy tickets live. Some people buy them the year before. Like let's say Comic Con twenty sixteen. When people leave Comic Con twenty fifteen, they like, they leave the door, they reserve their tickets there already. Yeah, Jeez. well that yeah, yeah that and like uh BlizzCon. That that too that too mm-hmm. like, it, people buy them like the day after yeah kind of thing yeah, which crazy. I mean BlizzCon is kind of like a different thing because it's really like you are you know you're a Blizz fan and everyone's like there to hang out it's kind of like it's kind of like Mayhan I guess it's like everyone's there just to have a good time they're not really there to pl- see line, something play stuff we'll see stuff like like it's not E three where you go there to see stuff right it's right. hang out kind of thing. Hmm. But there is like tournaments and other stuff there and reveals at BlizzCon too. But yeah, uh, but ticket prices are up there too. But then you get also lots of good stuff, free stuff. So. I might go to Anime Expo. Yeah, it's a four day thing, but I'm only gonna pay for pay for one day. Yeah. Minecon's c- coming here. It's Anaheim, right? Yes. Yeah, yeah, I remember. Yeah. So. Yeah. But the thing is, is like you guys were kind of man on the ticket price, which is yeah. Like, if it's like over a hundred, yeah. it it's most likely. And for one day. No, I think that's for multiple days. I'm not sure. Maybe. I'm trying to track it down. It, 
that hasn't been announced yeah, when no the tickets are going to be on sale. Yet. It's my con tickets are kind of harder to buy because it's really like they just give no warning and it's like it's up, it's sold out, it's up, it's now uh, it's completely sold out again, yeah. kind of thing. So it's really sorry. Yeah. So yeah, it's kind of I'm kind of gonna go check around the like past years to kind of figure out what it is. Mm-hmm. But I mean, the fact that it's like right ten minutes away, we should definitely look at <laughs> but at the same time it's yeah, expensive though yeah i don't have that much money either so i'm i mean we'll, we'll see once the yeah you know, price we'll see. yeah comes up. we'll see because uh i mean last time it was last couple times the ticket prices have been high but that's because it was in europe oh okay so it, one it could be the currency exchange rate might be higher and then also you know taxes and yeah. land, you know it's different it's a different country and then, what time is this the first year where it's handled by Microsoft? It is, right? Yeah. So things might be different. I thought they did one last year was when they first, no, I guess, like. Not. Well, no, last year, I think last year it was owned by Microsoft, but it was, like, right after it was bought, like, a couple months or something. Mm-hmm. But, yeah, this is, like, I think the first full on legit like yeah microsoft they have a whole package yeah so so it might be lower in price it might be maybe, better it might be worse it might be ticket price <laughs> ticket ways to buy t- the ticket might be easier mm-hmm. now so okay. yeah but yeah that's the other thing uh but yeah i thought it was division was all right going back to it <laughs> okay <laughs> because i got off on a tangent um what did you guys think of it good. it's good it's good um I take it definitely not Destiny level good. It was a good distraction right now that it's in its low times. Mm-hmm. I still will go back to play it to try to get at least one high end mm. weapon. I crafted mine. You crafted yours? Did you yeah. do the pistol? Yeah. I don't want to do the pistol. Yeah. I never use the pistol. I know. So but I'm not going to make it. I so I'd rather. Does. What? Well, I mean, if you have the shield and you use the pistol, but yeah. Well, yeah, I guess. Yeah, I never use the shield. <laughs> no. Yeah. Uh. Oh, well, I, 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 I did it because I was like, oh, I, I just need to do this one thing to get achievement. I'm like, oh, well, I might as well do it. Plus, mine was like level 15 pistol or something. So I'm like, I need a really good pistol. Oh, okay. I need a new pistol. And I want to get like a. I have everything legendary right now. Yeah. It's I, pretty good. Yeah, I have that too. But I have a. I heard they also have like exotic gear. That's yeah. the high end. They call it high end. Okay, high end. Yeah. It's, it's, still it's still yellow. It's still yellow. So it's, it's still... the same colors. It's just... Yeah. They're just... I mean, high end is like meh. It's high end because it just does a ton of damage. Yeah. But there's nothing like... If you headshot this guy, he's going to explode into like green light and stuff. Oh, there's no... There's no like... No. There's no mm, like the Destiny exotics have. Well, that's because of that Destiny is an alien game. Yeah, it's space. fantasy. And then the here's... Thing, I, uh, cleaners have i want that kind of a gun. dlc maybe yeah maybe. i can kind of see that yeah uh the boss flamethrowers which have like a mile geez. distance range I think killed me. yeah yeah uh did you unlock the base upgrade where you can like uh re-roll your stats oh the um i don't know what it's called i know what you're talking about yeah uh, that yes. thing. Right. i haven't, I haven't really, done it though i haven't done it because i need like lots of money have and... you fully upgraded your base Yes. Like yeah. everything? Everything. Oh, okay. That was one thing that, like, uh, like I got to, like, I finished the game, uh, finished the game at, like, level 28, 29, and then I'm like, well, I'm going to go around and do, like, some side missions to get, like, the last few upgrades, mm-hmm. because I, I was only need, like, three or four upgrades left. I'm oh, okay. 10% medical and 0% everything else. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We're going to die. Yeah. I am 100% in security Ooh. 80% in tech and 90% in medical mm. so I just need I think three more nice and I, I need the small ones Th- the very first upgrades that I did were the thousand ones because those are good they're really good yeah and then when you start doing the little ones especially in the medical you yeah. can increase your filter level which is like you can do yeah yeah and better stuff better gear well, that, yeah. that was medical was like the first one I kind of really went after because mm-hmm. Uh, because of that, you know, the increased filter thing, because I'm uh-huh. like, well, I can then go anywhere. Because there's some areas where it's, like, level two, uh, or I don't know what it is. Yeah, it's uh, it's up to level four. Yeah. I'm level four right now. I don't think, I haven't seen any higher than that. You, it maxes four, so. Oh, okay. that, 
Unless DLC comes I'm out. I'm level one. Yeah. I can't get to level two. No. No. Well, you did just start. Yeah. That's true, too. I yeah. know uh, Surfer has, like, maybe 30 hours more in, in the game than you me. a lot of hours. I, I yeah. check your stats. Yeah. I do. Yeah. You beat him. Mm. Yeah. I guess. Well, you were playing it a lot at the beginning. Right now you stopped, but you were playing it a lot. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of bouncing around games right now, so I'm like... You're at 80 hours or something? Was least. it that much? Yeah. Yeah. When I, I checked the, yeah. <laughs> the Xbox out. Well, I, I guess a lot of, There was a lot of... Uh, I kind of left it idling oh, for a little bit. Oh, you went to heat up your tea? Stuff, stuff. like that. Yeah, <laughs> stuff like that. So yeah. so 10 of those hours are tea? Uh, let's say five. Part. Yeah. So, five or tea ten. hours. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> But, like, yeah, then, like, a lot of it was, you know, just running around doing yeah. side missions and stuff. Like, I I really want... Because uh, when you clear an area of all side missions... It gives you, like, small XP bonus when you go back to the house, the safe house. Uh, that, and it gives you a, a blueprint for, like, a legendary. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. So I, I did that for, like, 60 to 80% of the map. So I'm it, the last few areas is, like, the ones that, like level 25 and 30 the yeah the top right yeah. ones so that's about it i think you... i've done like fully fully maybe two or three safe houses mm. look uh, areas mm. and they're, they're it's not that bad yeah it's not that bad you can do it pretty you guys easy. explore all the city or just parts of it still i just went to side mission to side mission i really mission. explored I probably explored like 75 yeah well, I mean, I explore the entire city, but I'll probably be dead. Well, when you say, what do you mean by explore? Do you mean like go look around for the hell of it? Yeah. To me, explore is pretty much you have discovered this area. Yeah, like that's yeah, that's that's what I do. Oh, that yeah. like explore to you, I think, is like go to the beach, go to the <laughs> like. See what's under this rock. <laughs> read this magazine. On, yeah, read that's this like magazine. propped up on the map. Like, like, I want to see the whole map because I have because I've only seen like part of the map so far. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Like I just discovered Hell's Kitchen, and but that's I don't know where that part is. That okay. area is really hard. Yeah. Well, you play like Fallout and stuff, so you really go into that yeah, kind of exploring, does. and that's like that rewards you in that type of game. But in this game, it's not really. Not really, no. No. You get like a, a little bonus XP when you discover an area, but that's you pretty get like much it. You, you do that when you just cross the border. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. You just like, there's a clear border, it says what level, you cross it. Oh, you discovered this place. Oh, mm-hmm. you discovered the UK. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then you just go to safe house and it gives you all the side missions. Yeah. Um. Solid game, though. Yeah. yeah. Solid game. I really like it. How long do you think you would play it? Like, Destiny came out a couple years ago, yeah. and we're still playing it. How how long do you think you will continually come back to it? I mean, I know the main question it is... It needs a good multiplayer part. Mm-hmm. Because the multiplayer in this, you just basically go to the Dark Zone and, I guess, look for gear. Right. But there's also PvE in it. Right. There's no deathmatch kind of game where you just go four against four mm. human players mm. where'd you that, think of the matchmaking that's e- huh I like what'd you think of the matchmaking because like you were talking matchmaking about, yeah you didn't really care for that I match made like maybe two or three times yeah it was not a good experience no, no. why wasn't that a good experience because okay there was one where I jumped into the game it took like five minutes just to load up or anything mm. I don't know why it took forever, mm. but it took like five minutes just to load up into his world, mm-hmm. like as the party leader. Right. And then he just walked off the border and canceled the mission because you know how there's like a mission boundary, I guess. Yeah. And you can walk away from it and it cancels the mission. Right. And that's what he did. So I had to go away from his world, which yeah. took another five minutes. Yeah. And then just reload in and try, I guess, by that myself. That happened more than like once, or happened. A couple uh, times? That happened once, and then another one. Um, we were doing, I think it was like maybe the third to last mission, which was pretty hard. Yeah, it was the one with the sniper, the sniper girl, like the gang leader. That's a sniper. Uh, I think it was that one. Is it in like a fashion show area? No, it's in the armory. I think they call it. Yeah, I guess you call it a fashion show area. Yeah, I think I know what you mean. Yeah. But anyways, that. I jumped into that. Mm-hmm. Um, we died, all of us. And there was a guy there that just would not revive us. <laughs> he was just running around in circles, running away from the bus, from the boss, and he wouldn't revive us. And it was just annoying. And mm. it, There was no team play. 
Right. There was no team play. I've had the... When did you do these matchmaking? Did you do it recently or a long time ago? Mm, like, when it first came like, out? No, not when it first came out. Maybe, like, a week ago. Okay, so... Yeah. Uh, I... Yeah, I did about a week ago. I've had the exact opposite. Everyone was reviving me. There was, like, a few games where I was, like... Everyone was level 30, and I was level 28. And the level 30s were constantly carrying me, and they are like, constantly making sure I was okay. Did you talk to them? No. No? No. Okay. I think that Dark Zone is a little better for that. Because I would just... I went in there by myself a couple times. Yeah. And I think, like, twice I was invited into their party. Mm-hmm. And I joined their party. Like, hey, want to come with us? We're grinding the the, um, the chests. Mm-hmm. We can open them so we can get some legendaries. I'm like, oh, sure. And now, I went see, with that and it, it was fun. Now, see, I get the opposite in the Dark Zone. When guys come to see me they shoot me and kill me <laughs> no that still happens it still happens yeah but i mean it's better to join a group because if they see you all together they're not going to attack you yeah but yeah there are some yeah, pretty that, rogue trolls yeah the dark zone it's like you it's better to be with a group because the if you're by yourself you're by yourself you there's by no yourself, one yeah. to back you up basically yeah. so yeah. but uh but yeah in terms of multiplayer i mean i did uh, quite a few missions. I did like one or two missions multiplayer that, uh, and a lot of it was like really good. Um, like I did on hard because, you know, it was all four of us, so it's okay. easier, but at the same time it gets harder because there's more people, yeah. but, um, but I wanted to like, you know, better gear or something. So mm-hmm. I did that for a little bit, but I mostly did all the missions normal just to get yeah, story. Yeah, me too. Me too. Like, ah, I don't care about doing hard. Yeah. It wasn't too much of a different. Because, in terms of like getting loot, not the loot, but definitely the difficulty. Well, I mean, like getting a really nice weapon for that mission versus waiting and getting the mission just randomly. Mm-hmm. It yeah. wasn't that much of a penalty, kind of thing. I felt like it was at least doing it by myself. Mm. If I went on normal, it would take me twenty minutes. Right. And if I did it on hard, it would take me forty minutes. I didn't think it was worth it to do it on hard. I think it was just better to do normal and then another normal and it would give me more experience and I would advance more mm. towards the mission, uh, I guess, campaign. Yeah, so, but like uh, I did a few hard just to try it, you know, to see how it was. And, uh, well, we did hard when we were playing at the beginning. Yeah, we did a that. Of them. Well, I mean, like in terms of matchmaking, just to try it with random people, see, you know, because we, you know, we do a lot. I do, um, we do that. Nah, we've done a lot of Destiny random matchmaking with like no mics or anything. Right, and we can. It's easy to you know figure out. Okay, you go here, you go here. You don't have to. You don't really have to talk or anything. I, I was seeing how far I could get without talking because this is very strategic kind of game. It's kind of like Army of Two where you do aggro, right? Okay, sure. Yeah. You know, like someone draws the fire of the eyes, and then the other one sneaks around with like a silence weapons and like, yes, shoots mm-hmm. them back. Mm-hmm. I've done that a few times with like my turret. I would set the turret up and just sneak around them. Oh, on on division. Yeah, division. Okay, okay, yeah, because in Destiny you kind of do need to talk. Well, yeah, mm. you do. Well, Not, I mean, depends what you're doing. What we, are you talking about? I'm talking about like weekly strikes. Okay, yeah, for that, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. You're right. Yeah, mm-hmm. you don't. You don't right. really need to communicate. Yeah, yeah. You yeah. gotta know after a few times that this is how you do it. Especially if you've done it for two years. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh yeah, they're bringing I think two strikes. No, just one. The Winter's Run. You know which one that is? Yeah. The one with the capsule? Yeah, they're making it now taken. They're making it taken. They're taking easing it. Yeah, it's gonna be pretty fun. You yeah. mean the one where it's like, um, it's like on the shelf, and then there's like a giant pod that opens up and the yeah. thing comes out. Yeah, oh. that one. Okay. Uh huh. With it's gonna be, it's gonna come with specific loot to that raid, yeah. not raid, uh, strike. Yeah. Is this sword from there? I don't know. I don't think so. That might be a little too easy. I think the sword is gonna be kind of like a quest. A quest line to grab it. Mm. Kind of like but the, there's the original There's another one where it takes, it's in the Hellmouth. That's the other strike. Oh, the completely new one? Yeah. Yeah. I wonder how that's going to be. Oh, with uh, Malik. Malik is the boss's name. The mouse. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but like, uh, let's see, what was I talking about? Oh, yeah. There was one good matchmaking thing, the moment that I had liked. Uh, there was I forget what it was, but it was like uh, it was re- really hard. Uh, 
it was like a construction site or something and there was like a boss that you eventually got to and you had to crawl through like a a whole thing and then you can go out and then there's like a boss on the other side that's like uh this was division yeah division crawl through a hole yeah it's like i i don't know what it was but basically we we kept me and the four player group kept doing it over and over again and we kept dying mm -hmm. horribly uh but you could like try to cheese it by like staying on like the other side because you crawl it's a construction site and there's like this like hole that you crawl through okay and it's like a wall and but when you drop on the other side you can't go back up and on there's oh, oh and, i know which one you're talking about yeah 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 and but but before you drop uh on the other side of the wall when you go up into the hole uh there's like a re restocks uh box so okay. you could just like go hop up shoot everything go down heal restock, restock <laughs> go back up uh so we me and another guy were trying to do that but and then the other guys would go over die instantly and then, then because it was on hard mm -hmm. and then me and another guy we kind of knew how to do it but we died if one of us dies up there it would be hard to revive kind of thing so it'd be better to die down there yeah it's better well if one of us got went down we would crawl off the edge and then go down it and, and then Mm. At one point, we kind of learned, okay, you go up, and then I go up, and then you go up. So that way, at least one of us stays. We die together. Yeah, but then we still died, kind of thing. And then, <laughs> and eventually, two guys left, and it was just me and the other guy. And then we were like, well, let's just try it a few more times, kind of thing. You know, but, and so we went, we just kind of went ahead. We didn't, we kind of went off the box, mm -hmm. um, down into, like, the area to see how that was. Uh, and then we went over to, like, a, a thing up there. There's like kind of like a hiding spot. It's like you can shoot down at everyone. Okay. Yeah. I know which one. And it took a while, but eventually he would constantly heal me, and then I would constantly put down like uh, the thing that boosts your uh, cover. Okay. That uh -huh. thing. I constantly doing that, and then he would also put it down. It, it stacks, so it does double damage. So it took a while, but I would constantly snipe the guy, and then it was just like a something that took four people but kept failing it took That's just two of us work. i do thing. like all the skills yeah i do like that yeah like right now i have the um the health skill which heals you not that much but it gives you damage resistance and like, is that the shield or is that no it's one of the healing ones it has like arrows pointing up or something uh okay is that the one where you click both bumpers no that's the, the super okay what, what are you talking have, about Okay, you have the skill, the one, either the left bumper or right bumper. Right. Right, the healing one. Uh -huh. You know how it has mods? Mm. Are you talk which one are you talking about? The, are you talking about the healing one where you get the first one or the healing one with the box? Oh, no, the regular healing, not okay. the backpack. Okay. The regular healing, one of the mods, if you use it, it increases your damage resistance. Okay. So you die less. I mostly use the box. We're talking about division, by the way. Uh -huh. uh, are we? Yes. Yes, we are. <laughs> <laughs> well, we've been jumping topics for a while now. Mm -hmm. so, uh, But I've mostly been using the box because I snipe. I do use a lot of the sniper. Uh, so what I do is I put the box down. And so especially with like an R sniper, I put the box down. And it will he constantly heal me as I'm s shooting and stomping the guy. And then when I get low health, I just hide in the cover and get help my health fall back. Yeah. Versus like the one-time use thing. I, I mm -hmm. don't really use that. That and the ball. I use that a lot. With the fire grenade. The ball with the fire, with the fire grenade. Yeah. That's really good. Yeah. Uh, um, I started using the... Um, which was the other one? The, the turret? One of the, no, not the turret. Not the ball. Shield. I don't know. Basically, what I did is I... My... My gameplay to give, like, max DPS. Where I would kill... The, bosses like super fast or something oh is this the scanning one okay yeah there, there's a mod on it where wherever you scan you give you you, t you give it more damage to your weapon it's like, a damage multiplier yeah, yeah. that that <laughs> that yeah yeah and then i also have the the super right is the security one which also gives you extra damage and damage resistance hmm so right now I can kill things pretty. I kind of been bouncing around between all three for the mm -hmm. uh, the super, so yeah. I don't know. I haven't really found a favorite. Um, they're all pretty good. Yeah, they're all pretty good. Yeah. So and far, since, since I die a lot, my brother puts the 
the one where he shoots and auto revives the person that's down right because i die a lot <laughs> okay yeah yeah you do that yeah what about you necro wait which one do you like so far for division, I'm. Well, really only, he only has one. Well, I have the well, he's healing also... and the the shield, but I really like the shield. Mm. But, I, but but I can see that you can upgrade the shield, so I kind of want to see where that goes. Yeah. Right. That'd be some big ass thing. Yeah. No, that's not gonna happen. No. <laughs> you can also toss. Well, like there it. is uh, heavy machine guns. I want because I got one of the heavy um, machine guns in the beta. Oh okay. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, you did. I got one of those. I I don't like them. I'm sorry. I don't like them. I like. You this. start shooting and it goes like. <laughs> I know there's a lot of recoil. In it. Yeah, it, but once you like once level, you level it out, it, that devastation. That yeah, happens yeah, yeah. Because it has like 100 yeah. ammo in the clip. Yeah. Well, you yeah. probably didn't get a good one because I I got a good heavy uh, light machine guns and it's pretty stable. So I guess yeah, it's probably just the one. I I I've yeah, kind of I kind of yeah, saw yeah. that it's like Borderlands <laughs> where you have. Uh, each different ammo type. So if you keep like all your guns in your inventory, and if you run out of ammo of one, if you switch guns, you you have ammo from that gun. Yes. Oh, okay. So, so like if you equip, let's say, two so, assault rifles. No. Is that what you mean? No. Like if I run. Oh, a, like an assault rifle and a heavy machine gun. Yeah. Well, You're well, gonna use this ammo, but not this ammo. Is that you, what you mean? Well, that and like if you run out of sniper ammo and you switch to a shotgun, you have shotgun ammo. Oh, I see what you mean. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yes. So. I I've, right. I've been I, so throughout the game I always had like five guns that I constantly would always level up kind okay. of thing and so I I kind of played around with it I, I like the shotgun but uh, it's not always good I I just kind of stick with like sniper for like the higher stuff yeah. I can snipe from a distance and then like assault rifle or some kind of machine gun to kind of really take out guys quickly as they sure. run towards me yeah me too that's what I did yeah. sniper and assault rifle yeah sometimes submachine guns some machine guns are pretty good yeah. They have a very low clip, though. Small yeah. clip. So far, I like it, but uh, the problem I'm having is for the normal missions, it's extremely hard. Because I'm at level... Because I, th- I think the highest right now is level 9 mission. That's the one I can go to right now. Uh-huh. I'm level 8, but it's extremely hard just to kill the boss. Mm. Like, I have to go through He's it. the one in the mall with the, the cleaner with, with the extremely guy. long... When, fire launcher yeah he fire darted at me he ran at me with all that gear he ran straight at me yeah that one we we didn't let's play that was really difficult for just us two did we do yeah. it on hard or normal i think we did hard i think we did hard yes yeah yeah so two of us yeah on hard and it was hard it was hard <laughs> that guy scared the shit out of me. We, uh i think when i got to that point again i'm like eh, i'm gonna do normal matchmaking <laughs> do it for people just yeah. to bleep Brace, uh, blaze for I was running away from like I went up at the stairs and he like literally chased after me. Yeah, so usually he, he's pretty slow, it's the other guys that yeah. come at you really fast, but he darted at me. I'm like, oh my god, <laughs> yeah, where do I go? Yeah. yeah, uh, with that, uh, there's like a few points like that where it's like it's really difficult, so I just match make, yeah, ran, mm-hmm. with random people, even if the people are like really bad or just trolls, eventually. You'll get through the mission. It's a good revive. What's the <laughs> most uh, that, that like you can play like a mission? Like what's what's like the most people? Is it four. Like four. It's four. Four. Okay. Yeah, yeah, four is the max. Four. four is the max. Yeah. yeah. I do don't like how, like I tried helping Necro on his missions, like mm. when he first joined. Yeah. But they would go up in difficulty. I was level twenty nine at the time, and they would be le- the enemies would be level twenty nine. They would just so shoot he, me he, once. They would look at him like. They would like shoot me like in the arm oh, and I'd be dead. Because you Necro joined your game. No, I joined no, his game. You drew, joined mine. And it That's... went up drastically to like this well, level. It was no. me and my brother. Okay. So yeah. it was like one level twenty nine, one level twenty seven, and one level eight. Yeah. So maybe that's why why it went up too much. But like Mm, that's not supposed to happen. But like would it still go on uh, well, it happened to me, I don't know. Even if like you just joined me, would it still go up? Or would it be like because when I was a higher level, like you mean did mission, right? Mm-hmm. And when I joined your game... It went to your favor? No. Uh, basically, what would happen, like, let's say Fluffs was like 19, I was like 21. Mm-hmm. The, lo- the enemies would be 21 for me, but they would be 19 for Fluffs. So it's... Because it wasn't like that for mine. No, because yeah. they were really high level for you, yeah. right? Because he had the skull on them. Yeah. Well, it was a mission? It was all purple. It was a mission. And you had like yeah. five yellows come out. 
or it, yeah. it, it was that one part with the garage where they blow it up and yeah, and, four yellows and it was up. normal too. I mean, we didn't even do yeah, hard. We didn't do hard. Mm. We'll have to check it out. Later. I don't know something went wrong. Something was hiding. Yeah. Well, and then talking about something going wrong, I I glitched into stuff twice. Once when that one mission where you had to kill the rogue agent. Mm-hmm. Oh. I was gonna die, yeah. so I do- I rolled away, but I rolled into a wall, mm-hmm. and I went into the wall, and I couldn't get out anymore. Did you record it? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> so I had to kill myself, uh. <laughs> and we were about to pass it too. Uh. And then another one, you know those like those big storage crates? Yeah. I went into one once, same by rolling, and I couldn't get out. I had, no, there was nothing inside. <laughs> just. Just the fluffs. Exotic gear inside. Just the fluffs. Mm. And I had to kill myself again. Yeah. Okay. That was not fun. Uh, all right. We're kind of running out of time. Let's just breeze through uh, the themes, a few things we saw. Uh, we did watch Overwatch. We did. The um, cinematic. Yeah. So Winston there's then. Yeah. It's so it's like a, it's, it's a mm-hmm. character animation. Yeah. Kind of thing. It's similar to like Team Fortress 2. Uh, meet the character. Like mm-hmm. meet the doctor. Meet the sniper. Okay. Kind of thing. I think they're going to do more, which I hope so. I kind of like it because it was like, I mean, the Team Fortress things, those were like one to two or like two or three minutes. This was like a nine minute short. Yeah. It's pretty it, good. It was a high quality, high, very high quality. It was like a Disney movie kind of mm-hmm. level yeah. kind of detail, yeah. which is nice. I'm always go, good for those. Um, but it was like, uh, it was really high quality and stuff. Uh, but then we saw a little bit of the story behind it. You guys haven't really seen too much of Overwatch before. Mm, no. No. I mean, just, just the trailer. reveal trailer and then this and backstory. This one, yeah. thing. Yeah. I, when I was at Blizzard I, or BlizzCon, I didn't actually get to play it. You did so, get to play it? Yeah. I played it two or three times. Mm-hmm. So I, I got a good idea of it. Have you guys ever seen or played Team Fortress 2? Well, you played Plants or vs. I, Zombies. I can't... Right? Yes. That, it's somewhat... I know what it's like, though. Yeah. It does look my, like my kind of game. Yeah, it's it. Mm-hmm. Well, you like you pointed out when we're watching the gameplay. It's similar. The like you know, you protect like the thing that's going through the area kind mm-hmm. of thing. That's that's like actually like a callback to like Team Fortress Two and stuff. It, it came. I'm not sure if it came from there, but or it was yeah. very popular there. And mm-hmm. I know Plants vs Zombies is also like that, where mm-hmm. you protect it or you choose like your character to, like that has like special abilities and yeah. all that. So it's a very similar style or that game type which you like quite a bit so i I've, do yeah. so you probably will we'll check it out um Definitely. kind of thing uh i i like in terms of like watchdogs and stuff i always like i don't know until i played it and right now after playing it, i do i am definitely excited for it mm-hmm. so but it's like i usually don't play a lot of multiplayers kind of thing but it's really like eh. and so, is that one multiplayer only Yes. I think it is, huh? Yes, it is. Yeah, it's so. like Timefall or Plants vs. Zombies yeah, or Titanfall something. Yeah, kind of um, But yeah, it's it's in the... Car- for me right now, it's in the category of like Timefall, which is I will I like it enough that I'll play it on my own, but I'm not sure how long it will hold my attention. Okay. Because I play Timefall quite a bit by myself, like in my free time and stuff, but after a point, it kind of got old, so then I moved on. It was like two or three weeks. Hello, Jared. Not our Jared. Another Jared. <laughs> oh, hi. Yeah. Yep. Um. So there's that. Uh, what did you guys think of the cinematic short and the gameplay? Oh, it was definitely nice. I mean, I like the like. I always like story. That's that's my big thing. Yeah. So I got to see backstory about the. They need to make a movie. <laughs> well, or Blizzard... watch the movie. <laughs> well, they are coming off a of War, uh, Warcraft movie. <laughs> That's live yeah, action. Yeah, that's live action though. Like, yeah. yeah, I don't know how I feel about it. Yeah, I mean, sure, it would be good. Maybe. I will not watch it in theaters. I don't think so. No, no, I don't think so. Mm. I'll probably just wait for it, like Netflix. in theaters, but in the two dollar theaters. Okay. okay. Netflix on demand, DVD, whatever. Yeah. Well, Netflix it takes forever to get yeah. a movie. It so. does. Yeah. Um. But yeah, it's good. There's also Doom. Doom. Doom is coming it's out. Also, also coming out in May. Yeah, They're it is. They're both coming out in May. Yeah. yeah. Um, I'm... Those kills on there. <laughs> yeah. A lot of people the assassinations. Are... Yeah, the assassinations. Oh, yeah. A lot of people aren't too excited about the campaign of Doom, but I'm actually excited for the campaign. Yeah. Um, yeah, me too. I'm, me too. I mean, there's also... 
uh, multiplayer, but then also uh, Forge mode or whatever it's called. Um, I know the name of it. It has some like original name, but yeah, you can pretty much build your own map. And then also like, you know, you can control like AI and stuff and like spawners and stuff. Mm -hmm. You can make your own like, uh, what's the thing in, in Halo where you forge? No. Uh, you go against waves of enemies. Fire. Fire fight. Was it fire fight? I think so. Okay. Yeah. That thing. Mm-hmm. Like you can make, your, I think you can make your own version of that. That's cool. So you you can definitely, it's like a uh, little big planet controls where you can like customize very detailed mm-hmm. of like at how the map works and stuff. So I'm excited. Should be a good game. Yeah. May is going to be a good month. Yeah. I have my concert in May. Is there anything coming out in April? I don't think so. Just destiny, but I... yeah, I guess destiny. Yeah, uh, just destiny. nothing else. I don't have high expectations for this Destiny update. No, just, I mean, it's gonna be good, but it's not know. gonna add story. It's just gonna add just a little bit. It, it's gonna add. It, new, it's it's like a good. Varix has new dialogue, but that's it. Yeah. It's like uh Fallout Four's DLC. It's five dollars or something right now. It's like adds a few mechs and a few things, but it's not. Yeah, it's not too big. Much. Kind There's of thing. A little bit of story just just from the lore, but yeah, it's not that big. No. So yeah, that's kind of where that mm-hmm. is. Yeah. Um, Queen Breaker's bow. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Uh, I guess one last one last thing. We we talked a lot about VR last time, but we didn't really talk about would. Did we ever talk about like if we would now that we kind of know a lot about it, or like if you, any of us would actually get VR, like what type of model or something? Well, I'm still getting the same Sam, Sam Samsung Gear VR. Right. It, I'm already approved. Okay. I'm just waiting for it to ship to me. Okay. They so have, I'm gonna have they are, are they in the stores? Yes. So you can, you can so you can actually buy it. But, I think it's like ninety bucks or something. Yeah, but you're waiting for the, your free version. I'm getting for my free one. Yeah. Waiting for my free one. Yeah. Okay. I'll wait. I don't know about it. You don't know. Well, I could always bring it along and you can try it. And well, then if you I'll, like it. I'll try it then. Well, I mean, like, in terms of VR, because there's, like... Any VR. Yeah, like, any VR. There's PlayStation How many v- games are for uh, uh, VR? Lots of them. Lots. Well, it's it, already, it like depends a, especially on... Especially the Oculus. It depends on what sh- VR goggles you get, because, like, the PlayStation VR, it's cheaper, but it's more limited. Like, you can't do th- walking around. You can't turn, like, all the way around in your chair. Mm-hmm. Like, uh, can I play Fallout with the VR? Can I play Destiny with oh, VR? Oh, no. No, uh, no, no, no. It has to be... No, s- sort of. There, PlayStation VR, there is one a guaranteed feature, which is you can have a virtual big screen TV okay. that you can play any game on. But then also, some developers will go back and you can do that. Of, like, moving around. It's It won't be as smooth because it's, like... It's not made for VR, but you could. I wouldn't do it. No, I would just use the big sp- your, your actual TV. No, yeah. yeah. I, I'm kind of interested about the the vir- virtual like, TV. Do you feel like that you're there? Is that mainly the gameplay? Or well, whenever you put on VR, like people have gone back and do, done the Half Life, and people like there's like a bridge thing that you're, like you're crossing a big gap, and people get like vertigo when they like cross the bridge. So it's it can even though it's like a poor version of yeah. a VR, it it's still immersive. Just because they came out when, um, what was it, Killzone, and I think they had that gun thing, but it was used for another game as well. Mm-hmm. It was a SOCOM. Oh yeah, that and, and that that didn't really work. But it worked. It but the problem was your TV kind of. your TV was like tunnel vision. Now mm-hmm. that you got the goggles, I can actually see that working, and that was PlayStation Move too. Yeah. So and I, that was like what. Four years ago, yeah, it was like near near the end. Well, it wasn't maybe. Yeah, maybe guess, a little more. No, it was two. It was like 2012, 2011, but which is about four, like that, four, four, like four or five. Four or Experience like where you feel like that you're kind of there. I mean, like yeah, you, you said you can't move uh, your head. You have to. You move. can. Oh, you can move your head. on the new VRs. Yes, yeah, yeah. especially the Oculus. Okay. Yeah. Uh, what I was talking about li- it being limited was like. Oculus and Vive, well, those are PC versions. Okay. And and now we're going we we're, we're doing we're, this we're again. Going way over. Well, that's that fine. And th- well that <laughs> and we're, <laughs> we're saying this over again from my last podcast. Basically, like Oculus and VR uh, the Vive, those are PC only VR. Yeah. And those, those are the high end ones. Yeah, those are like the six and eight hundred goggles. Okay. Okay. Those, it's like 
you can uh i can set up this area and it could be a virtual area where we can walk around with the goggles okay mm-hmm. you can also sit in your chair and just like be in the pilot seat and fly around and you know pew, 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 and kind of things yeah you know, make sound effects okay. but like the playstation vr and the samsung gear vr you have to stay where you are you can't move around you can move your head but you can't, and also you can't move your head like 360 it's usually like 120 like around here yeah it's and well, then you could yeah. like go like this well like yeah the best example was like uh there's a game that's on all platforms which is job simulator yeah. where you are like a fr- like one example one job is a fry cook and like on the oculus and the live like your fridge is behind you so you would turn around and open your fridge and get your stuff and then go back to the grill and then flip stuff up on the playstation vr everything is in front of you so you can't there's nothing behind you so because the capability isn't there there's no okay. well basically there's no camera behind you mm. and that's the limits of that but playstation vr is 40 dollars and works with a ps4 versus you gotta buy the oculus or the or vive get a better good get a good computer and a good graphics card and then get a good space and then you're done yeah. so it's been a good couple thousand it's expensive bucks. yeah but i do like the different tiers of like vr so yeah, you can choose personally i could get a pc or get, uh, get a oculus or a vive i did test my computer it's on the low end of the recommended like there's uh, steam came out with a game that will that checks your computer okay well, you know uh-huh. it, t- it kind of does like a little portal thing yeah. it, it's kind of cool okay you know it tests it out and tells you like where you are on the scale and stuff uh and right now mine's on the lower end so if i just got a better video card i'll be pretty good okay but I don't have that much money to buy a Oculus or Vive, even though I could, it would be like six hundred plus, I guess two hundred for the video card. Yeah, to get eight hundred, and then the controllers, and then controllers. Yeah, since I already have the Move controllers, and it, I just need to buy the sixty dollars camera and the goggles, I it, it makes more sense to get that. The PSVR. Yeah, the PSVR. So that's my, where I. And there's at. also the PS4K rumors. Yeah, and it's not rumors. It's it's kind of confirmed, but not really. It's not really confirmed of what what it is, but there is gonna be something. Mm. basically there's like a better more beefier version of the playstation but i guess it's kind of like how the how xbox released the xbox elite they're calling it and then this is like the ps4k yeah it's kind of like that i I, because the the xbox elite had like a hybrid drive or something personally i think it's too much confusion for consoles because then it, it because that's the main problem with the pc is you know the verse have such a hard time because they gotta make a game that works on many different scenarios. Mm-hmm. Now it's like, okay, do you have a PlayStation 4 or PlayStation 4.5? Does it yeah. have this? Does it have that? Kind of thing. So it's like many questions versus one question. This is it. Stick to that. Yeah. I know. I know. So me, I don't know. Yeah. Uh, did you see the commercial where there is a roller coaster that has the Samsung VR? Yes. Isn't it like in Six Flags, I think? I don't know. Or Universal Studios, something it like that? In, no. It was... Uh... No, it was Six Flags. I think it was. I think Six it was Six Flags. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, like whoever had the the annual pass got to go to yeah. it. Like I guess be- beta test it. But there's there's two different ones. There's a alien thing, and then there's like some other jet thing, or I don't know what it's it was. Pretty cool though. That is pretty. I cool. would definitely pay for that. I'm like 50 50. I'm like sure if it's terrifying it, or yeah. awesome. Oh yeah, no, no, it's just definitely gonna be terrifying. Have something at the uh, uh, the spectrum that they're playing. Oh, it's the zombie thing where you put on it's it's goggles, but it's like a new zombie. It's the thing where when we went to Zootopia, was it that? And I think it is that. Uh, that's like uh, we saw it. We saw it in that but, girl. But like you put on it's it's kind yes. of a VR thing. Yes. Was it VR? If I was like just I like I thought it was just three D goggles. No, it wasn't. No, VR. no, no. It's actual VR. It's VR. Yeah, that's why I was excited. I'm like, okay, we're Zombies waiting for home. Necro and we're gonna go. <laughs> so we are going to go. Hopefully. Mm. This weekend? Yes. We could break early. Yes. yes. No, he no, has no, to be early. Really, I have to go okay. early today. Uh, they might be closed. But yeah, I'm not. I'm not sure because basically, yes. you're, because basically you're gonna be blindfolded on a roller coaster. It's more or less what it is. Uh, it's gonna be scary. I don't. I'm, I'm like, excited though. I, I know. It. I know you two are excited. I'm like, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. You're gonna hear like some girl screaming. Oh, it was those two guys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, because I, I just hope they 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 allow us to record. Like, maybe yeah. me and Necro can play it, but, like, you can be out there <laughs> just recording us, like, our reaction and stuff. Mm, maybe. Uh, the only thing is, you get motion sickness just seeing a chair moving your head around because it because of the V-Sync or the, the frame 
stutter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So having frame stutter on a roller coaster, that's I don't know. Yeah. Take some. I want it though. Take some bumming. I want to try it. Take some bumming. <laughs> that's I all I can say. It. We're going overtime. We are over. Uh, over the overtime. We have. We are in southern. We are in southern death mode. Yeah. I should have like a big graphic that goes southern death. Southern. Oh, is that what it is? Okay. I don't know. I'm just making up stuff now. Okay. Like, well, I think we're done then. We're I think done. We are. We brought to you by VR. There and was Division. one video, but I'm gonna save that for next week. Okay. As a teaser. All right. Yeah. So I am okay. Surfer Dude. I'm Necrothine. Flips. Yes. Uh, make sure you subscribe to us on YouTube so you don't miss our next episodes of our Let's Plays and fantastic stuff. And also be sure to subscribe to us on iTunes where you can find our podcast. It will help us greatly if you do. Yes. Um, check out podkey.com. Um, check out our social media stuff. Sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have to offer. Check you, out you, it all. You can go to YouTube. There's go there's, to podkey. There's, there's, there's there. some funny, um, there's some funny, um, there. some funny mic back in there. Yeah, there's good stuff. I'm, I'm actually building my portfo- uh, editing portfolio, and there's we got some good stuff. Okay, okay. Right. We got the good stuff. Okay. Yeah. I don't know what that means, but okay. Just say okay. Okay. So okay. okay. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs>